So I'm over here at the pilot. Uh, I stopped for uh, fuel and to have a burrito. Uh, this is the pilot off of, uh, I think it's Com Corbin, Corbin County pilot off of Cumberland Gap in Kentucky. And next thing you know, there was nobody in front of me, like in the parking lot here. I'm eating my burrito for lunch and I look up and there's some guy laying on the ground and a bunch of commotion. I thought somebody came through and ran him over or something. No, it's uh, apparently road rage. Uh, some truck driver, I don't know if it's the one over here hauling the oversized pool or the one that was over here in, in the uh, white Cascadia, they got, they got in a fight apparently over road rage and just kicked the shit out of the, the guy over here. Which I, it was a pretty bad move because there's literally, the sheriff was literally sitting right there when I pulled in. He was sitting right on the corner. So I don't know what they thought they were going to get away with or do. But, well, and, I, I don't know. Uh, pretty much, guys, it's not worth it. It's not worth, you know, sitting six months in jail for, for getting in a fight. I mean, you know, there's a difference between defending yourself and just coming up and sucker punching somebody. Which that's what looks up looks like just happened, like... I don't know, the guy looked like, from what I was told, was just walking in and the guy came up and just jabbed him. So, um, word of the wise, wow, maybe, I don't know, the sheriff, the sheriff's over here, he's backing up right now, um, he talked to the guy, and I don't see nobody in the back of the car, so... I'm guessing it's going to depend whether or not this guy presses charges, which I doubt it. I mean, I don't think I would. I don't know. It depends how messed up I was. But, uh, yeah, uh, keep your cool. It's not worth it. It's not worth it getting in a fight with a four-wheeler. It's not worth it getting in a fight with another truck driver. You know, there there are some states that, that have mutual combat, but, you know, it's, it's just not worth it. You know, I'd rather be at home in my bed with my old lady than than in a cell with Big Bubba, you know what I mean, uh, over something really stupid, um, you know, if you're going to fight somebody, I would probably make sure that they're not going to charge, you know, uh, press charges first, uh, but I don't know, the world we live in, so I'm, I'm going to throw up some of the footage I got, I wish, you know, I got the actual fight, but literally, I, I, saw some guys walking i was eating my lunch and next thing you know i look up and there's a guy on the ground and a bunch of commotion and now the sheriff's just driving back and forth i guess getting getting his take on the whole situation so you know i'll, I'll throw some more footage up i guess right after this but you know it's just not worth it guys keep cool um especially not worth it to get in a fight with a four-wheeler uh you're, you're gonna come out probably on the the losing end of that at least at least, uh, as, as much as the law is, you know, concerned, and insurance, and fines, and everything else, so, uh, sometimes it's just better to walk away, and enjoy the rest of your day, so. Well, I don't know what just happened at the truck stop over here in Kentucky. I'm sitting here ha trying to have lunch. I look up, next thing you know, there's somebody lying on the ground. Yo, what the heck, what the heck just happened? Yeah, I was just eating lunch. There was nobody there. I look up like five seconds, and there, there's a guy laying on the ground. Wait, do not come out? The cops right down the road.
right, well, apparently, apparently it's uh, tr trucker road rage is what, what just happened.